so I don't know if this is overkill salad, but when I was at the toy store, uh, I think I accidentally bought the pond fountain instead of just a simple pump fountain or fountain pump. And so I decided everybody was talking about aeration, so let's give this a whirl. So I just added the additional attachment, uh, <laughs> the bubbler attachment to see if that would just. I mean, it bubbles the water pretty nicely, and then it's still, it's still, you know, pumping at a good clip here. I have it turned down a little bit, and I am trying to find out exactly how long it takes for this top to cycle with that. And right now, I'm at uh, two minutes and 45 seconds. And you know, we're still going, so. We're to right there, so I don't know. We'll see which one wears out first, the recording here or the bed. So I have it plumbed here with a, a bell siphon. I don't have anything attached to the top to make it an easy, you know, to get it out. I'm just going to loop a piece of string around it and kind of like a noose and just pull it out. Go down here, see if I'll turn this up without dropping the phone. Cut is going through the wood. Here, 90 degree elbow over and another 90 degree elbow. I'm thinking about, well, I might punch holes here, like straight through on the very bottom, just to see if that would you know, do more aeration, but I think with this bubbler, if everybody thinks it's not such a bad idea, I'll just uh, keep it there. And I know that thing, I gotta put more water in here, but for right now, I think it's okay. Oh, here it goes. Get water all the way to the top. And then the siphon's starting. And it's gonna take over. There it goes. So we are at four and a half minutes. And down the water goes. Yeah, I know I need more water. Alright, well I'm going to cut it off at this. And that's how much it is pumping out of that. And it'll stop eventually.